Good morning, everybody! Are you having a good time? Get those arms up in the air. I want to hear the polar salute. Huzzah! in your canoes, forget those paddles, it's the pole you want. This is where it's all happening. So grab your 16 foot canoe or your 17 or your 15, it doesn't matter. Get your sense of balance. And you're ready to go. So why do we pole? Well, why not? <laughs> I mean, who would want to sit down when you can stand up and look down and have the ability to go upstream as easily as you go downstream? That's what limits most paddling, and I'm an avid paddler as well. I don't broadcast that, <laughs> but I'll let you in on the secret. I've been known to hoist a paddle now and then. But the hard part about river paddling is you need a shuttle, and you've got to be able to gain access to the upstream waters. That isn't always possible. I love going out early in the morning when the birds are out, the beavers are playing around, the deer are coming down to drink. Because I'm coming upstream. They aren't expecting me. They aren't looking for me. But what a great way to see the river early in the morning. And I don't need someone else to set up a shuttle. It's the independence of this sport that I truly enjoy. And again, just the ability to jump in and go out and play. Huzzah! 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 The wind has just picked up, <laughs> so the bowling session has uh, gone to the, <laughs> to the tubes. Cool though. Nice to be out with a bunch of campers that have no problem with uh, conditions like this. <laughs> Feel bad for the polars. How was it? It was Great. pretty good. Was it? Yeah, a little challenging. <laughs> challenging is a word? It was very windy. It was good. <laughs> That's great.